Hey guys, so I wanted to do a video. I know I've been gone forever. I think it's approaching like a month or something, but I've just been really busy with school and everything. It's crazy, but I'm here and I want to do a video. Um, one of my videos that will be coming up hopefully is a Black Friday haul. Black Friday, I believe, I know it's like toward the end of the month. I'm not sure which day it is just yet. Just give me a second. Okay, so it helps that my cupcake calendar is right behind me. It is the 29th, that is Black Friday, and expect a haul from either the same day or the day after or that weekend following. So that will definitely be a video, hopefully, if I can go. Um, but if not Black Friday, then I will try to do some hauling for the holidays. Um, so yeah, let me just jump into this video. I wanted to show the products from Bath & Body Works I'm currently using. This includes home fragrance, body care, and soaps. So let's jump in. I'm going to start off with home fragrance. The first thing is a Market Peach Candle. And this is from, I believe, the Fresh Picked line. And it smells really good. It's creamy. This is my second medium-sized candle I've had of it. It's one of my favorite home fragrance scents. It says, fresh from the stand, peaches strike a juicy note in a blend of vanilla featuring hints of citrus and raspberry. And it's just really, really delicious. I love it. And um, I only have a little bit left, but I don't think it's enough to burn. So I'm going to scrape it out and put it in my tart warmer because no wax goes wasted and the second candle this is my first three wick candle from bath and body works i know it's crazy this is mint chocolate and this came out over the summer i got it at the semi-annual sale online and this says semi-sweet chocolate dark cocoa and peppermint with vanilla cream and white chocolate and it's really really nice um you can see the wax is turning um color from it burning but um i mean it's kind of okay with me i don't mind it that much but mint chocolate is definitely um one of my favorite ice cream flavors so i was really excited to have this one and there will be like more in-depth reviews for these during my empties video um that's why i'm kind of just skimming through these products right now all right the next category is soaps so the first one is currently in the bathroom and it literally is almost gone. It has like the tiniest bit left. So this will be in an empties video. I'll probably be able to stash it in there probably by tomorrow. Um, it seriously has the tiniest little bit of liquid. But it's iced gingerbread from last year and this just smells delicious. Really sweet, deep, rich gingerbread flavor with a like hint of frosting no um they don't have descriptions on the soaps but they do online but um it's just i love the packaging and the font and the picture and the color scheme i just love it all this one is in the kitchen and it is le kitchen lemon and oh my goodness this is probably like the seven thousandth kitchen lemon we've ever had in the kitchen it's a repurchase i mean it's just a staple in our kitchen. I just used one up in my last empty video and now, um, you know, we're using another one. So here's Kitchen Lemon. Again, we use the foaming if you didn't know. And it's just a staple, nice, clean, fresh lemon scent. And the one in the downstairs bathroom, Winter Candy Apple, again from last year. We haven't purchased any of the new winter or fall soaps this year but hopefully we will when either they go seven for 20 or maybe even for the semi-annual sale when they drop down to three dollars or even cheaper um that's like when we bought all of these soaps uh the christmas ones and the fall ones from last year we bought at the semi-annual sale last winter and my mom just stocked up on them like crazy like it took us a while to get through these fall and winter soaps and we just got done using our wait no we have one more fall soap after we use up this one and i believe it's sweet cinnamon pumpkin 
but after that it's just all winter soaps vanilla bean noel is down there twisted peppermint is down there um some more winter candy apple it's just winter soaps in our upstairs bathroom so be prepared to see those and i feel like we've caught up right on time because it is approaching kind of the winter season so anyways winter candy apple this is just really good i've had this in a pocket bag like two or three years ago and i fell in love it's sweet without being overly sweet it's fruity without being overly fruity it's just a really nice scent and i plan to get this in body care this year. okay and the next category are mini sizes so i'm using a pocket bag and this is island nectar and i'm a little bit above the halfway mark this is just really nice it's a really fruity tropical fruity scent it's not like your average apple or orange it's like pineapple maybe some guava mango it's just really nice um i like it and it's not too overpowering um these i will always continue to buy because i mean you can never be too clean okay um what i'm currently using in my purse a travel size spray and pair some more um the cap is somewhere in my purse it keeps falling off but anyway love this scent it's a staple for me it's my favorite signature collection scent um at bath and body works and i have a little bit um about a fourth of a way left so this should be in an empties video soon um, my next empties video might be the beginning of december hopefully and if not then then definitely by new year's definitely by new year's the first mini size lotion i'm using is sweet on paris i'm using two of them this one I'm using in my purse. Um, it's really sweet. It's like blackberry and lemon meringue. It's compared to berry vanilla and it smells delicious. And um, for some reason, it's the lotion is coating the bottle even though it's um, about down there. So I have like a little bit left to use. So I should be done with that by the end of the month. And then Malibu Heat is another preview size lotion I'm using. I'm using this on, um, I leave it like on, wrong way, my window seal right there. I'm using it on my window seal right there where the air fresheners and stuff are. Um, just because this scent is a little bit overpowering. It's pineapple, orange, and coconut. But it's very strong. So I just keep this at home so I don't like really bother anybody with it but it is a really good scent though I do like it and the last category is body care even though this is not from Bath and Body Works it's from its sister company Victoria's Secret I love Victoria's Secret um, sometimes I think their body care is a little bit better than Bath and Body Works especially when it comes to packaging like Victoria's Secret it just makes me want to just grab all of it i don't even care what the scent is and barely any store makes me feel like that like i feel like i'm not the type of person that just buys something because it looks nice but victoria's secret does that to me so i'm using a full ritual of the signature most popular scent love spell um if you've never heard of love spell i don't know where you've been no, i'm just kidding but it is very very popular it's a staple it's like new york cheesecake and victoria's secret love spell i mean you just have to know about it so i'm using the daily body wash um, of love spell and the scent is cherry blossom and peach and you guys know i'm not a big floral person but honestly i cannot even smell it all I know is it's just very fruity and girly scented and I like it. So that's the um, body wash. It's a gel consistency. And this again should be in an empties video soon. And I have the body lotion and I'm about right there. So about a fourth of the way down. Um, I bought this a couple months ago and I got it literally for $2.50 plus tax or $2 plus tax 
and I like it. Um, body lotion is good. I prefer body lotions over triple moisture body creams actually because you get more product in them for the same price at Victoria's Secret. They're both $12. Um, I believe the triple moisture or the body cream is not triple moisture body cream. That's Bath and Body Works. But the body cream I believe has like 6 point something ounces and this has 8.4. So um, I kind of do prefer the lotions. And my skin doesn't really need a lot of moisture anyway. Um, so I just stick with the lotions. It's just my personal preference. And the body spray. I'm using Love Spell Shimmer. Shimmer Mist. And I'm not a huge fan of Shimmer Mists. But um, I got this at a semi-annual sale. I believe the beginning of 2012. So the winter one. Like turning 2012. So, I mean, it was 3 bucks, 75% off on a table, and I got three, like, body sprays, and this was one of them. Um, the other one I used up in another empties video, and the other one I gave as a gift. I believe it was, like, pure seduction. But, um, yeah, I really like this one. And, I mean, I don't mind the shimmer. I wouldn't, probably wouldn't reach out for it, be like, ooh, shimmer mist. No, I wouldn't. But if this is all they had and they didn't have the regular one, then I would get it because they didn't have the regular one on sale. It was just a shimmer mist. Um, so I think it's okay. I mean, it doesn't bother me all that much, but it's just not something I would gravitate toward. But it is nice though, and I do like it. And I'm using it up at a pretty good rate, I think. So, so that's that is nice. that are wait the uh, those are all the products I. I'm currently using from Bath and Body Works and from Home Fragrance to Body Care to Soap to Travel Size Things. Um, so yeah, sorry for no video. I'm just really busy and I'll try to op upload this by um, maybe Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday. Today is the third. So um, I hope you guys have a great week and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!